I was driving through town uh, and I was listening to a radio interview and I don't know who it was I was talking about. There was someone from Fairshire saying about the work they did and I what, what, you know, picked up the food from the supermarkets and redistributed it and I thought, that sounds worthwhile. You know. The whole idea of Fairshire is getting food out to different charities. Bottom line being, we could not actually get them vans out delivering food without the volunteers. I hate to see food waste in my own home and when you see the amount of stuff you know, that is lost every day um, in shops and businesses, food suppliers, uh, and yet there are people going hungry, so I think it's something very practical and worthwhile. Well, it's a very, very day. Sometimes you're driving the van, you're maybe going to uh, suppliers to pick up food. Uh, at other times, you're driving the van and delivering the food, and you're actually seeing the people who are going to actually be benefiting from the food. So it's, a, it's just a whole very day and all the, the volunteers here have a good feel-good factor about them and they all believe in what they're doing. The, the, the crack here is very good. It's, it's good, good camaraderie amongst everyone. So, so many different people from all different types of walks of life. But we're, it's, it's, a, it's, like a, it's a melting pot for everyone. Uh, and, and it really is. There's no, there's no arguments, there's no fights, it's all, but it's all good, good, very, very, very good humour. The volunteers, when they, they get started, we do put them through food hygiene. We do put them through health and safety, which are both accredited courses. And if the volunteers are here any length of time, we do put them through their fork truck training, which is a benefit to them and a benefit to us. And if anybody wants to volunteer for us, just uh, phone or email, I'll get them in, application rep up, interview done, and hopefully get them started that day.